We're going to talk about today, what do you allow into your home? What do you allow to come into your home? In Proverbs chapter 15 and verse 17, it says, Better is a dish of vegetables where love is than a fattened ox with, served with hatred. I don't allow hatred in my home. Sure, I, ha I raised, we raised three children, and sometimes they didn't get along, and sometimes they, sometimes they didn't see the eye to eye. So I let them argue to a certain extent, but if it got too heated, or it was getting out of hand, it was stirring up strife, then I put a stop to it. I'm the dad of the house, that's what you're supposed to do. Didn't like to do it, but got to do it. And one thing I never allowed in our home was fighting at the dinner table. My father taught me that from a young age when I lived at home. We talked at the dinner table, but we talked about things that were good. Ask, how'd your day go? How you doing? Hey, guess what? You know, we're getting close to Christmas. Things like that. We didn't ever fight at the dinner table. If you start arguing at the dinner table, even if you weren't a family member, if you were an invited guest in our house, my dad would just look over at him and say, my dad had a real tack about this. I don't know why. People, boy, they listen. He was like E.F. Hutton. Was like, he says, now look, we don't allow arguing at our dinner table. Now when it stopped. And they stopped. That was it. I knew what was going to happen next. If they didn't, he'd ask them to get up and leave. Because the dinner table was a place of peace. My dad was the last one to get done eating. And I never seen my dad take anything for his stomach. I never heard him talk about being sick at his stomach. I never heard him mention anything about being nervous. You said, yeah, but your dad was so much older than you. you know, he died when you were 18. Well, from the time I was a baby until I was 18 years old, I ate a lot of meals with my dad. He didn't allow that in the home. And I didn't either. And I learned that the table is a peaceful place where we all interact. And it's one place you can sit down and talk, but you can't argue and you can't fight. It says, in, uh, if we turn over to Proverbs 17 and 1, it says, Better is a dry marshal and quietness with it than a house full of feasting and strife. The Bible doesn't like strife. Strife among the brethren strife at the dinner table so what you allow into your home is on you and we should not allow strife fighting arguing randy did you ever ask anybody to leave your home unfortunately i had to a couple of times because people got out of hand i told them you either calm down stop arguing or you need to leave and they left and so it didn't bother me but it's my home and when in rome do as the romans do don't allow things in your home you shouldn't have god love you